What do the characters of Fablehaven and the sequel series Dragon Watch think of Brandon Marl? Honestly, I think he forgets that we're kids. Every book feels like the danger is growing. I think Mr. Mole needs to bump up the danger. Give readers what they really want. And what exactly is that? Duh. Me fighting more dragons. I think Mr. Mole crossed the line when he made Seth and I co-caretakers of a dragon preserve. Seriously, two words. Psychological examination. Are you worried that by calling out Mr. Mull, he might have you, say, eaten by a dragon in the next book? Please. He can't kill me. He needs me. He tries to kill me all the time. I can usually dodge it. Hi, I'm Brandon Mole. I send kids to battle sea zombies or survive a sea dragon or confront the Under King. Like I said, Brandon Mole needs me. It doesn't get much better than battling the powers of the underworld. What about your part with Ronigan, the Dark Unicorn? Next question. Brandon Mole is an exceptional human. Mr. Mole, if you ever watch this, just let me say, I won't let you down. You want mischief and chaos? <laughs> Keep me around and I won't disappoint. Like in chapter 19, when Seth and I went into that I'm down here! Oh, there you are. And what do you think of Brandon Mull? Three cheers for Brandon Mull! Hip hip hooray! Hip hip hooray! Hip hip oh. We thought it only fair to give author Brandon Mull a chance to respond to his recent criticism. Okay. I stand by my previous statement that no mermen were harmed in the making of this book. Well, there you have it. Get your copy of Dragon Watch Master of the Phantom Isle, available nationwide.